just measuring here. Kind of tried to figure out the middle of the pool because I don't really want to be swimming to one side or the other. Hopefully I can see in the center. So if you can see guys too, you can take these lines off if you need to, if you don't want them hanging out outside all the time or get bleached from the sun or whatever. And excuse the mess on the table from the kids eating, but uh, here's this. I'm gonna set this up. Here's that little ball on the end and I'm gonna set up the, the length. I'm trying to read the instructions and I, I think I have this figured out, hopefully. So here goes nothing. All right, got my suit on. I am super excited. Uh, so I'm gonna get my cap goggles, take the cover off and freeze my butt off. Here goes nothing. So I apologize in the background, Jonah is crying. He had just woken up from a nap and was very cranky. Um, so with this line that I changed for the medium, it did feel a little bit stronger, um, but I still felt like I needed some more resistance. And here you're gonna see Chet pulling on the line and I had no idea he was doing that. Um, I, he was just trying to see if I needed something or a little less slack, I guess, in the line. Um, so I think I stopped because I was like, what the heck, I feel like it's really pulling right now. But um, he adjusted the line here and uh, later on I actually end up switching out the uh, line and putting in the hard resistance and that felt a lot better. So here you are going to see, I'm gonna start out again, and I'm getting it pretty close to the end of the pool, the other side. You know, ideally I wanna be like more in the center of the pool or even closer to the other side. Um, so I definitely am going to have to go back and adjust this. I am glad I recorded it, cause it's really hard to tell where I'm at in the pool. Since I don't have lines or anything like a normal, uh, you know, 25 meter pool. Here I'm gonna try fly, and I can't do too many because my knee is really bad. So that was about as much as I could do there without <laughs> not being able to walk. So that was fly, that didn't actually feel too bad. Um, I feel like the line is maybe a little high, it needs to be lower because it, it messes with your gravity a little bit or like your center line in the pool, even when you do have your head down as much as you can and forward, um, you still feel like it's a little cattywampus. I'm not sure exactly how to explain it, but just, it didn't, I, I feel a little off. So this next one, you are going to see me, I believe I'm gonna do breaststroke. And that didn't feel too bad, but again, my knee can only take so much. Uh, so there's my breast. And then after this, I flip my line around to my stomach and I try backstroke. Now, don't make fun of my backstroke. It's my least favorite stroke, but I just wanted to try them all out on this line and they all felt amazing. So, um, yeah.
I highly recommend recording yourself, by the way. I haven't done this in years, and I can see things that I've gotten into bad habits, like looking up there, um, kind of back, just, I don't know, it's just something I've done in the pool when you're watching the lane, or like where you're at, or if you're close to the wall. You still have those weird, stupid habits, even when you're on the line, I guess. But I am glad I record this, so I can, uh, definitely correct some things that I am doing wrong. So I tried to start my watch just to kind of keep track of my time and um, it wasn't too bad. I definitely am slower in the line. It's just something to get used to, but it's better than not having anything or not being able to swim and exercise. Um, so what I recommend is I will have to look up the device name, but you can stick it in your cap and it will tell you or make a beep like beep. Um, you know, you can set it to maybe say you swim a minute 15 hundred. Uh, you can have it beep like that so you know you are keeping your cadence. Um, so once you get to that minute 15, you'll know you swam a mile. Uh, you can also have it beep to keep that cadence. So it's every beep, 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 beep. Um, so you can keep your stroke going and uh, you know stay on track since it is harder when you're on a static line like this. Um, so once I order that, I'll do a review as well. Um, it's been a long time since I've used one of those, but I definitely recommend it, especially if you're going to swim like this and you want to keep uh, your speed up and, um, and yeah, so I hope you guys enjoyed watching this video. Um, please definitely give me a thumbs up, subscribe, I'm going to try to do more uh, videos and uh, some more box openings and maybe some pool gear and stuff like that that I've always wanted to try out. So thank you guys so much for watching and um, I'll see you later. Bye.